Hello everyone, I welcome you all to the Scratch Programming. Today we are on fourth topic, working with two sprites. Students, I told you in the first lecture of Scratch Programming that the motto of the Scratch Programming is to imagine, program and share. So, I have imagined this story of two penguins. So now, Let's see how to put our imagination into produce our scratch interface. We will move to our scratch interface. So this is our scratch. We need two penguins. We don't need this cat. So we will delete it. Now you all know that how to add the sprites on the stage. So I'll go in the animals and from here we will choose the penguin okay so you see I added one penguin that is one sprite and I have got two costumes okay costumes are nothing but they are alternate appearance of a sprite only like when we talk to each other we make some hands motion and just our position changes so likewise it just changes the looks of the penguin you just see okay now we will go to the sprite list again and we will go to the animals again and we will choose another penguin okay now I'll keep it here and here let it be of bit small size so I will reduce the size okay let this be of a bit bigger size so we will increase the size now you just notice this bank this sprite has got two costumes a and b and this sprite has got three costumes okay so it is just a movement of its body okay now we will be programming the first sprite for programming where we need to go we need to go to the script area okay before starting the script I would like to tell you that I will be using motion block event block control block and looks blocks these four blocks along with sounds block so we will be using these five blocks motion will be for the movement looks for seeing the dialogues and switching the costume sound for adding the sound whatever sound we will choose we can play it event we know that our every event start with this green flag so I'll be using event block for this green flag and one more thing you just notice the block the sub blocks and the block the color is similar so if I'll choose a block from the event block it will be of brown color okay and control block if I want uh, to add the wait timing so I need to control the conversation so I'll be using this wait and repeat forever from the control block I hope you have got some idea what is the purpose of these blocks so I will start writing the script for our first penguin so I have chosen this green flag from the event block now I want my penguin to move at least 10 steps so I'll use the motion block C the color is similar let's give it 20 steps okay now the moment I'll click it it will come forward okay so I want my first sprite to say something so I'll go to the looks block and my penguin will say my penguin will say hello uncle how are you and it has said some dialogue so it should wait for some time why it has to wait because the second sprite has to speak now so we will start this script for this also event block now what it will do it will wait for some time why it will wait because the sprite first is talking so I'll give it to now it will say 
something it will reply something it will say hello my dear child i i'm good and wait for a second and we'll say what are you up to okay now it has said some dialogue so it should wait now at least for 2 seconds and now we will go back to the first penguin it will wait it was waiting now we want we have two costume i want to change the costume okay so let's change the costume got it after changing it should wait for some time let it be one second then it will say something because uncle has said something now it uh, the first penguin has to reply it will say what it should say it should say uncle i want to learn skating can you please teach me it said something now what it should do it should wait for some time let it be 2 seconds okay now it said something now what uncle will say uncle will say something uncle will say yes sure let's start practice from tomorrow and should wait for 2 minutes and it should switch i think to the costume so i'll go to the looks block switch to penguin c right so this conversation is done now it should wait for some time okay now it had said that sure we will practice from tomorrow this penguin has said uncle can we learn so he has said yes sure so now it will say we'll go to the looks block and we'll say thank you uncle and we'll wait for some time and then looks and then we'll say bye right and it will say change the costume let's start the practice from tomorrow and it should wait for a minute and then i think we have three costume here so we will change to costume c and say bye bye we'll say bye bye okay now we have this blank area as a stage so it is not looking good so let's add some good background to it so this would be good for this now this uh, is looking more interesting see so uh, our script is almost ready but i think it is incomplete without a music so let's see if music works for us go to the sound go to the library 
and choose this um, let's go to the music loop uh, let's choose this okay this chosen sound must have come in the looks block uh, no the sound block so let's choose this until done and see if it works so i hope you have understood now so did you notice we use this presentation green button stop button backdrop to sprites and used costume also and today we learnt the working of these few blocks motion for the movement and sound for adding the sound i hope you have learned to work with two sprites you if you like the video just press the like button and subscribe the channel and uh, please keep practicing God bless you all.